Hello everyone, it is your one and only and of course favorite gaming weasel back again with an interesting topic to talk about. What is the best Warframe inside of Warframe as of the day of recording this video, which is August? Is there such a thing called the best Warframe and what are good Warframes for, I guess, good tasks inside of Warframe? We will be covering all of that in this juicy video, of course, that I've prepared for you today but before we do of course as always you know a self plug at the beginning of the video subscribes and also likes are greatly greatly appreciated by me and are always amazing to see you guys and becoming weasels and joining my you know subscriber or i guess fan base and weasel army or whatever you want to call yourselves uh, i still don't have a specific name for you guys but uh, that would be very very good and in the comment section down below it would be nice to see what do you guys think of this video sort of a commentary type of video uh, so yeah leave your thoughts down in the description below or comments down below so, what is uh, the best Warframe, or I guess who is the best Warframe inside of Warframe? Well, uh, currently there is no such thing in Warframe as a best Warframe. We're just gonna get that right out of the way, just so you guys don't th think you know it's like clickbait or stuff. There is no best Warframe at every single thing in the game. There are Warframes that are very close to being that. I have to say, for example, Octavia. She can do basically everything she can hold a certain area she's good at survival defense mobile defense she's pretty good at uh, also spy missions because she can go invisible uh, i guess uh, through some means and uh, she is decently fast so you can you know capture and extermination missions can be done with her as well so basically octavia's is a pretty de decent all-round warframe that you can you know play around with and have fun with it as well uh, i'm not counting of course helmet abilities because we can make really really good warframe combinations with helmet abilities so we're just going to be covering the base of warframe but uh, if you're a new player maybe join the game wondering what is the best warframe for you to get well it all depends try it out uh, play it play the warframe check out some videos on youtube how the warframe plays and stuff like that and then you're gonna find out which one is best for for you in my opinion there is always a best warframe for a certain situation for example wukong i would say is the best spy frame and also sort of capture missions and exterminate because he can do them fast i usually do uh, most of my uh, capture spy and or any missions that i need to be really fast i will do with wukong because of his cloud walker ability being easy to control and easy to travel with uh, you don't bump into walls and stuff like that now there is a little bit of titania gameplay in the background i usually use her for uh playing uh, corrupted mod hunts because she is very very good because of her of course uh fourth ability turning into that little butterfly and the razor wing well it's augment making her incredibly fast honestly in my opinion too fast basically if i am like i'm 99 sure she is the fastest warframe inside of the game uh, but uh, i do prefer using wukong a little bit more but nonetheless titania is a great warframe to for example do you know, missions such as capture fisher missions she's really good for that extermination missions uh, she's really good at void floods if you're still playing uh, the zeremon stuff uh, she's really really decent and uh, awesome all, all around the warframe and plus you got her if you watched tenocon which makes it even even better Better. I will not be showing any builds for you guys because there's probably some on my channel, maybe on some other people's channels. So this is basically just covering, I guess, the best Warframe in quotation marks inside of the game. Survival. It, it, it's the same story for survival, for example. Uh, survival missions, I would prefer using uh, Revenant. Wukong is pretty decent at surviving as well. I would prefer Nidus. For me, Nidus is one of the most unkillable Warframes in the game. You basically set up your third ability, your fourth ability, and you are set to survive without any issues at all. Oberon is actually pretty decent at surviving as well. He's really good with dealing damage. There are also Warframes that are really good against Eidolons. For, uh, for example, I see a lot of people using Volt. Uh, to fight Eidolons, of course, combined with a great weapon. He is an amazing Warframe. Um, of course, let's say some other Warframes. Let me just think of some real quick. Uh, quick. Wisp, for example, is a great buffing Warframe. Uh, also, Hero is, is a decent, I guess, combination of both. He can, he can buff himself and his allies, and he can also do incredible amounts of damage and survive a lot of punishment. So, basically... 
uh, not to prolong this video any more than I need to, uh, the, the best Warframe, uh, or I guess a best Warframe inside of Warframe does not exist. There are uh, best Warframes for certain categories, and of course there are sort of runner-ups to those categories, like, let's say, Survival, Capture, and then Spy, and stuff like that. So, there is no such thing as an ultimate best Warframe that can do everything basically really, really, really good. There are Warframes that can do everything good, but not amazing and there are better warframes for certain aspects but that is of course one of the amazing features inside of warframe and what makes it really interesting because it makes you switch up the gameplay and switch up your warframe from time to time but yeah this has been it this has been me the gaming wiz hope you guys enjoyed this little bit of a rant sort of video and uh, talking about the best warframe in, in the game and if you guys did do leave a like and do subscribe i'll be greatly appreciated and comment down below what you think of this little discussion that we had here so Hope you guys enjoyed, and this has been the Game Weasel, over and out.